Ever wondered how crucial breastfeeding could be for a child's health? The focus of our discussion today is a comprehensive study aimed at understanding the effects of optimal breastfeeding on overall and infection-related mortality in infants and children from birth to 23 months. Let's dive into the methodology of the study to understand it further. The researchers conducted a systematic review. This comprehensive process involved comparing the effects of varying degrees of breastfeeding, from predominant and partial to no breastfeeding at all, against exclusive breastfeeding. The impact on mortality rates in the first six months of life was assessed, as well as the effect of non-breastfeeding compared to any breastfeeding on mortality rates between 6 and 23 months of age. For this extensive research, the scholars scoured through databases like PubMed, Cochrane Central, and CABI. Now that we know how the study was conducted, let's talk about what was found. The results of the study were indeed eye-opening. It exposed the stark reality that the risk of all-cause mortality is significantly higher in infants aged 0 to 5 months who are predominantly, partially, or not breastfed at all, compared to those who are exclusively breastfed. Let's consider the numbers. Predominantly breastfed infants faced 1.5 times the risk, partially breastfed infants faced nearly 5 times the risk, and non-breastfed infants faced a staggering 14 times the risk. Moving forward to children aged 6 to 23 months, those not breastfed had nearly double the risk of mortality. The study also revealed increased infection-related mortality risks. Infants who were not exclusively breastfed faced up to 8.5 times the risk, and the risk was twofold higher in non-breastfed children aged 6 to 23 months. So what do these findings mean for infant health? The evidence gathered from the study has significant implications for infant health. It underscores the importance of optimal breastfeeding practices during infancy and early childhood. The findings reveal that non-breastfeeding or partial breastfeeding can significantly increase the risk of mortality and infections in infants. With the risk of all-cause mortality and infection-related mortality being substantially higher in non-breastfed infants, it's clear that optimal breastfeeding practices are not just beneficial, but crucial. This study clearly highlights the irreplaceable role of breastfeeding in ensuring the health and survival of infants and young children.